Hey there YouTube, my name is Tyler and I am Mr. Game and Beer and welcome to a co-op let's play of For the King, which is a early access game on Steam right now uh, by Iron Oak Games. It's a really cool little indie roguelike um, tabletop gaming RPG adventure game sort of thing with lots of elements from games like uh, Heroes of Might and Magic and that sort of thing. But it's a uh, it's quite a bit of fun. We've played around with a little bit of it, just to familiarize, familiarize ourselves. And uh, joining me today is John and Jason. Hello. Yes, hello. And we've uh, we've played very briefly. I think I've got uh, six hours logged in the game right now. And um, yeah, let's just give it a go. And as per Rumble. tradition, as to as is tradition, we would be bug testing and yeah, exactly. <laughs> stumbling across all of We refuse to play any game that is not buggy. <laughs> yes. And uh, since it is early access and they, this is like the first time that they've been testing out uh, online multiplayer capabilities, we are going to encounter bugs. So prepare for that. Oh, we should have gone over classes, but oh well. Uh, read this. The Brink of Chaos. The land of Farrell has enjoyed a golden age of unity and prosperity ushered in by King Bronner, a great hero and benevolent ruler. Sadly, in Bronner's twilight years, that golden age came crashing to an end. As unnatural forces of chaos began to bloom across the land, Bronner was murdered in his palace at the capital city of Perid by a mysterious assailant. The bereaved Queen Rossaman stepped forth to shepherd the people of Farrell through this dark time. With an unknown enemy in their midst and chaos unleashing ancient forces of corruption and death, Rossaman's first act was to call on the heroes of old, who had helped Bronner keep the land peaceful for decades. Retired soldiers and knights took mounted swords down from where they hung over mantles, fetched creaky armor from sheds and cellars, and set out to save the world once more. Before long, these old champions lay dead, their valor having finally failed them. The one old hero Rossaman had most hoped to see was... Meriglio Vexor, Bronner's oldest friend and former court wizard. Vexor was a, an expert on magic and chaos energy and would surely have a theory about these recent threats. But Vexor had vanished years ago, and she could only guess the wizard had met with a dark fate of his own. Rossman had no choice but to call on the ordinary citizens of Farrell to accept a great burden, leave their homes, abandon their vocations, and seek throughout the world in search of the source of these troubles. In so doing, she has entrusted the survival of her kingdom, of the very civilization of the world, to the citizens themselves. And though many will surely perish in the quest, the citizens clamor to answer the call of their beloved queen. Yeah, so this game also, it, uh, it says right in like the opening screens that you are going to die a lot, so be used to seeing us die. <laughs> no. <laughs> Who wants... the wizard Vexa vanishes, then my own husband was slain in his palace. You may be the last hope of Feral. Said okay. Rosie. Seek out Hildebrandt in Woodsmoke. You will be told how best to aid our efforts. Your quest has begun. You must complete it within 14 rounds. Otherwise, our kingdom will be consumed by chaos. Chaos. Best objectives. Go to Woodsmoke in the Guardian Forest. I'm actually going to turn up my, um, my game volume here real quick. Do, 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 do. I'm a scholar. I get to go first. Oh, I'm little, slow. Little cantrips. Yeah, so yeah, we didn't Jason's talk about our classes, but um, Jason, why don't you go ahead? I just, that was it. You're a scholar, that's it? That's really all you have to say? I'm a scholar and a couple little cantrips. Nice. <laughs> and John, you are playing? I am a blacksmith, and I have a hammer. Nice. And a shield. My god, oh. the black well. Yeah, found the, black the royal droll. <laughs> Almost this haunt can be sealed <laughs> by defeating the scourge within it, or risk it awakening when chaos rises. Oh, how droll! How droll! <laughs> royal droll. <laughs> uh, okay. And I'm playing a busker. I use a loot. It's fun. <laughs> Should we bust into this black wall? I don't know what's the level. Ah, uh, uh, get in. Find out. <laughs> Oh, it's two. <laughs> Might be a little early for that. Yeah. Plus, we these crows. Yeah, yeah. And um, you've got like a very limited <laughs> amount of time to do the first couple ambushed. quests. Been ambushed by a crow. This is the combat system. Keep this shit, folks. Oh. Oh, I lost some money. Oh, no, I didn't. Nothing to steal. Tried to steal. <laughs> yeah, what? 
That crow decided that nothing you have is worth its time. <laughs> Where's all the shiny shit? Did it just run? Yep. What a piece of crap. That's usually what they do is just try and steal something and then run away. <laughs> Horrible. Uh, so this is the how the movement works. Everything, or most things in this game, are determined by rolls, and a number of successes that you get determines how successful you are at that. Uh, so for the movement, you automatically get two successes, and then based on like your your speed stat, I think it is, you uh, yes. get extra rolls. So I managed to get a full five. That Wait. is also why I roll so slow. Yeah. Going to fight this uh, crow swarm and that hag. Yeah. Amen. F him up. Also yeah. worth noting, this uh, the combat system is is pretty interesting. Uh, essentially, everything that you have in those red hexes is going to get drawn into the uh, combat. So that includes enemies and allies. If you don't have allies in those hexes, you're going into combat alone. And uh, yeah, that's about it. You can ambush it to just get the crow solo, and you can use things called focus to accept or. Uh, uh, improve, it. yeah, or boost your um, your chance of success. Juice it up. Yeah. Well, let's just go through a fight so we can we can see how that works from a first person. Mm-hmm. Oh, my character occasionally dis- uh, distracts as well. He's just so pretty. Nice. Nice. <laughs> Good luck. Good luck. These crows. So um, should I try and kill whom? I reckon if you AOE, you could get both the crows. I could get both Maybe. the crows, or I could get a hag and a crow. Oh, you can only do two. Y- yeah. I cannot AOE, so I cannot kill two things. I don't think. Okay, so okay. see how my. Uh, my base percentage to hit here is 76%, and then if I add focus, which are these little hexagons down here, it increases that percent, as well as uh, my chance at perfecting it. So I'm going to go ahead and do two, just to expedite this combat. And I still fucked it up. <laughs> and I killed nobody. And I deserve this. Guess I'll just do everything. Yep. <laughs> I thought Shockwave hit everything, but I guess I was wrong. I think only on perfect. Um, Do it, Jason. Should have used all my focus. Oh. Nice. Well done. Thanks. Yeah, I used two focus and I still fucked it up. God. Uh, pass. I'll take it. I guess. Yeah, and the loot system after combat is kind of mmo You can collect or pass or all that business. Who's this, this guy? Who's that guy? Merchant. That Armor guy? merchants? Ooh. They have no gold. Yeah. Yeah. I guess we'll just... He's probably not going to be there for long either. That's too bad. Oh. Let's keep killing stuff. Stuff. I'm going to fight oh. this beast worm. By yourself? No, you're in here. What? Thanks, John. The opposite way. <laughs> you're welcome. I thought Jason was in it too, but yeah, it would not. make sense. I thought I thought it was closer. Uh, let's just go ahead. Nice. Only six health. Ooh, ooh, indeed. Also, yeah, if you're... I don't want to oh. go for it. Yeah. On a perfect, it, I do five splash damage with shockwave. Oh yeah, and it's only two ones next to it, right? Yeah. Nice. nice. Good distraction. Okay. Good Jeez. rolls. Such a bully. Good dancing. Uh, I'll pass that along to you, I guess. I will collect. I'll pass that along to you. Wow. Honey you. sponge. Nice. What is this uh, standing stone there? Oh, I'm going to. Got a book on it. Yeah, so it could be for me. What's it say? I need it's XP. Uh, full heal, twenty-five percent XP modifier. Wow. 
<clears throat> yeah, sure. I'm a little low on health. Even though it is in the opposite direction where we're going. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Keep up the good work, guys. You greedy bastards. We're adventurers, Tyler. <laughs> um, I'm actually a busker. Why don't you go stand in town for 10 turns? I'd like to just yeah. stay in the library. Uh, well, I'm gonna head on, on the right direction here. Grambushed. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice day. Okay, you. Good luck, good luck. Oh, I can get this too? No. But it's. Devote we to kill receive. this hag together, John. Devote to receive. Yeah, sure. I can't get to the hag, actually. You can get close too enough slow. for Jason to get to the hag. This is true. Okay, this is already been clay. Okay. I told ya. I was. I, I had oh, to check. Is. Oh. Okay. That's gonna be without Jason. I'm not though. in there. Uh... <laughs> you retreat, you don't lose anything. Okay. Then I will just end my turn here. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, this game re definitely reminds me of playing like Hot Seat Heroes of Mind Magic. But <laughs> that it's, was great. It's Back more there. interactive, like player interactive, than that game was. Is it? Yeah, totally. Like, what do you mean when you say player interactive? Like, oh. we're all interacting with each other sort of thing? It's not a whole bunch of people okay, yeah. secretly yeah. plotting oh, against yeah. each other for stepping two in, hours, and then, <laughs> yeah. and then one and then hour all of the five combat. people who aren't playing just go away for a yeah. while. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> nice, good move, John. <laughs> I just love to hit women, that's all. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Wait, Do you're you a woman. This? Am I? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I had no idea. <laughs> I thought those were pecs. <laughs> Such big pecs being a blacksmith. Okay. Man, I assume so. I'm at plus 25% experience, but I only gained one from that. Oh, I didn't get any. <laughs> That's because I got all the experience. You just watched. Okay. Uh, always good to see new faces join the quest. I am Hildebrandt, the Queen's agent overseeing things in the Guardian Forest. Things are bad here. Really bad. All signs point to some evil folk hatching a plot underground. The deepest caves in the region are accessed through the glittering mines, but they've recently been sealed with dark magic. My sources have spotted a strange <laughs> contraption here in the Guardian Forest. Go investigate it. I think it's our best lead. And now we've got a quest to solve that thing. And Thank good thing goodness you guys are me right and Jason there. are on the case. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This guy worrying about the town when me and Jason are true adventurers. Oh, I need <laughs> I need some money. Um, one thing, one good thing about the uh, busker is that I can end my turn in town. Can I end my turn in town? Well, well, it just me... says end your turn instead of... Oh, here we go. End turn. <gasps> then I can entertain and get two gold. <laughs> Yippee. Oh, I thought that I had more gold of that, than that, but so I was looking fast. at the wrong person. I should have just come to meet you guys. I'm such a fool. I guess I'll... Do I need all of it? I hope. I have 90... No, it's 100%. I'm, I'm good. Hmm. Nice. We got lore. Yeah. Uh, so lore is used to unlock things in the game. Great work. They'll think twice about leaving their junk in my forest. <laughs> Looks like those purple road oh. folk didn't appreciate us breaking their big toy. I'd say it's time we formally introduce ourselves. Just prepare <laughs> for a good fight. Kill the chaos leader. Heck yeah. Right there. I'll leave it to you. I don't wait for time. Yeah. Good call. Uh, Let's kill the bees then. <clears throat> Just Bee missing swarm. Out on all the experience here. You've got. I'm gonna be such a little bitch. Oh, more than me. I'm down. I've been in every single fight. Mm -hmm. 
You're you've been a very aggressive uh, blacksmith. <laughs> Let's nice. protect the forest. I guess I'll just kill one. That damage. Probably should have just used shockwave. Whiz. B whiz. Oh. Honey. Did you just pass that to me? Oh no, okay. You use it. I was like, did you pass that to me, you crazy bastard? Uh, I will collect this, I guess. Yeah. Oh, what's that statue? Statue. Uh, plus twelve experience, so like that. Catch me up. Well, I'm not that far ahead of town now. Or behind It's mine! Town. It's mine! Town. I'm just kidding, you can have it. Well, I did give no, you the I can't make it there. <laughs> you gave me what? Never mind. I gave you the uh, bonus experience statue. Oh, a dark oh, cave. Jesus. Queen Rossman? Jason? Oh, uh, the mysteries of Farrell are seemingly endless. You have stumbled upon Dark Cave. Aptly named. Oh, it's it's only like level one. Yeah. If you go in, will it drag us all? Yes. Yes. But we're all level it. zero too. Fuck it. We You're... could do the yeah. cult guy and then go in, or just do it now. What do you guys think? Cult guy first. I think we could take it. Okay. Let's go. I think we're gonna accept some chaos on not completing this other quest in time, though. This game is too spooky. It's I regret real, this already. Real spooky. Oh. I'm scared of everything in here. Oh. Nice. Well done. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, what no. What a jump. Like Chumpeton. Yeah, what did you just say? Oh, right. oh man. Oh. The ghost of Atromatos Maximus. <laughs> nice. Mine said Roy do Eldridge. You had to go. Oh really? Yeah. I guess that's one of the other things that's not uh, consistent through online yet. Yeah. The names of enemies? Ooh. Yeah, the names of those ghost guys. I wonder if those are all like Kickstarter backers or something. Here we go. Finish him. Oh, nice. I'm the challenger. You like my music? I do. Thanks, man. This is a tiny little dungeon. I don't know what you're worried about. Yeah, it's pretty small. I wasn't actually worried, I was just making jokes about being scared of skeletons. Oh, Jason, or Tyler was complaining about how long it's going to take us. Was like, yeah, yeah it's a couple, it's a few rounds. Oh, it's a rounds? Oh, Christ. Distract! <laughs> oh my god, it's got AoE! It does a lot of damage, or it's got a lot of uh, armor and resistance, too. Dang. I'm scared, guys. <laughs> He's almost dead. I like the little eye at the top of the... Yeah. Pretty cool. I don't think we can uh, kill him in one, one round. I might have to heal. Unless... Yeah. You want to use all your oh. focus. <laughs> Do I need to taunt now because you did this? Yes, please. <laughs> oh my god. You should be taunting anyway. I'm not gonna taunt every single round. No, but like taunting the first round, especially against a really tough... Like something that's two levels above us. Yeah, John, you're responsible for our safety as our tank. <laughs> Screw this shit. 
I don't think... No, I can't do enough to kill him. Fine. Oh. Well, you don't have to keep You only that, have right? to taunt one time. Really? Nope. <laughs> oh. oh, you did. <clears throat> Sometimes they just continue to attack me after that. But yeah. Always. Yeah. I think there must be like a, a hidden aggro stat or something. Fuck, man. Really? <laughs> Oh. Holy shit. Oh, you're gonna level up off this fight anyway. Yeah, but you guys actually have to kill him now. Oh, yeah. No problem. Thank goodness. Come on, eight. Experience. Mm. Who uses awareness? awareness? Uh, anybody like who's traveling. <laughs> it's just to, oh, I think right. it's pretty much just to see, uh, see enemies Secret before you just kind of run into them. Um, Ambushes. So I'll pass this along. I will equip this. Get rid of my silly horns. <laughs> Do we not get rid of my scar? Yeah, that would have been nice. Should I heal then? <laughs> yeah, we did Probably. not get experience. I'm gonna heal. heal. Fucked up. Oh man. Oh, oh shit. Uh, Angelo. For first level dungeon, this has a lot of the same enemies as the uh, second level ones. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. And each fight has like, a considerable amount in each. Okay. The ghost of Pigeonip. No, the ghost of Sir Lundsberg. <laughs> it must be. <laughs> ghost of Thomas Vinegar. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Well. Um. <laughs> now let's go to the cave idea. before the cult leader is said. Oh, we can I've got an idea. Yeah. <laughs> oh, can you only eat one item and then your turn's over? Yeah. Oh shit, we're screwed. <laughs> Jason, you just have to kill all of them. This. Oh, is valiant. <laughs> Two of us. Um. Ah, fuck it. I'm just gonna keep going. <laughs> okay. Boom. Play you yourself. One. Play yourself out. Oh shit. That crit. And that's for the king. All right. <laughs>